One of the major issues within the Grade Center is dealing with extra credit. If entered incorrectly, extra credit assignments can have a negative effect on the total points possible for your course. In this screencast today, we will learn how to properly add extra credit columns within the Grade Center. To begin, log into your Blackboard account and select a course container to work with. Go to your control panel, click on Grade Center, then click on Full Grade Center. First thing we need to do is to create a column for extra credit by clicking Create Column. Give a name to the column. Entering a Grade Center display name and description for the column is optional. Choose a primary display. Note, score is commonly used for the primary display for extra credit. Choosing a secondary display is optional and will only be available to the instructor. In the category drop-down menu for extra credit, choose no category from the drop-down menu if it is not already selected. Assign this extra credit assignment a point value of zero by entering zero for points possible. Assign a due date for this extra credit assignment by clicking on this radio button and then clicking on the calendar to select the due date. For your options, select Yes to include this column in Grade Center calculations. Choose whether you want to show this column to students or show statistics for this column to students in My Grades. Finally, click Submit to create the extra credit column. Back to the full Grade Center page, click the Chevron button for the total column. Select Edit Column Information from the drop-down menu. Scroll down to Area 3, Select Columns. In the section titled Include in Total, choose Selected Columns and Categories. Choose which columns and or categories to include in the Total Points column. To include extra credit, select the title you chose for the extra credit column and move it to the section titled Selected Columns by clicking on the center arrow. Once you are finished, click Submit to save your changes. That concludes this tutorial on how to properly add extra credit columns within the Grade Center.